crop tops and streetwear. Do you want to wear a crop top? Do you want to wear a crop top? Do you want to wear a crop top if you like streetwear? Um, hmm, not too sure actually. There's a little article from the old um, High Snobiety. Um, I'm not sure if this again, it, crop tops and streetwear are different from crop tops in men's in women's wear, right? Because I would say, first of all, women by and large don't really give a shit what their bodies look like in clothes. They'll just wear the item, right? For the most part. I'm not, you know, not generalizing, but I am. Uh, you would, you're not going to, you're not likely to see a fat dude wearing a men's crop top if he doesn't think he looks good in it, right? Whereas women will kind of have their guts out, will wear high-waisted jeans and have that little bottom belly fat thing going on. Like, women don't really care as much as guys do. And I guess visually as, as, as human beings, we don't necessarily think he looks that crazy because you know all girls do it um you know uh blah blah, blah. um yeah I, don't, I just don't think it's gonna be a thing with dudes because dudes would dudes would all have to be really in good shape to do it really skinny or you know again in good shape but let's see what this article says this is from high snobiety is men's way ready for a crop top revival i'm gonna say no fam but let's see what they got to say here um this is a crop top from ref this would this would work i think quite well this is from ref simmons um an oversized kind of crop top a uh, v-neck sweater sort of thing right that would work quite well with a nice t-shirt underneath how this guy's wearing it looks really nice um this article says the following uh crop tops or half shirts expose the midriff with a much uh tighter trim than your average t-shirt it's an example from rick owens fall winter collection below but unlike virtually every other 80s or 90s menswear trend that has surfaced over the last decade there has been no big crop top revival that said one of the biggest takeaways from paris fashion week in january was that the items traditionally showed to be women's wear such as handbags all of the men's runway yep you're seeing ghana wearing that massive chanel bag that he's been flossing you see luke's about wearing that um da -da -da -da, that mesa mangella quilted sort of bag that everyone's wearing now too so there's been obviously a big movement towards that kind of you know femininity a little bit of you know feminine touch a little bit of sensitivity a little bit of care and attention your crop accessories but i just don't know about the crop tops again my, the crop tops i did i have in my head is that famous famous picture of kid cuddy wearing a crop top at coachella and again he you know he's he's in good shape right so it works well on him i just don't think a guy with a bit of a gut would be comfortable wearing it in my opinion um again it continues after all, in the context of the fashion, the potential is all there. The crop top is sportswear. It's retro. It's androgynous, and it's a little bit. It's a little. It's a little ironic. And that's a little bit punk, right? This looks amazing. This Rick Owens kind of crop top. This looks fucking awesome. But this guy is ripped to fuck. He's got those. He's got those fucking V's on the side. He looks he like he works out. He's got the same body that kind of Rick Owens has himself, right? Which is probably why Rick Owens got him as a fit model. He essentially looks like a younger Rick Owens. Um, Dylan, for when pill okay, the does the new glasses they're making, they look awesome. Crop tops broke into menswear during the seventies and have come uh into slight oh was <laughs> is he getting a red carpet tucking in he does that all the time though, it looks anyway, but and again, he's like a fucking jacked NFL player. Mostly Dallas Cowboy running back Ezekiel Elliott made his crop top jersey a signature look while playing for Ohio State. In 2015, um, Elliot said to USA, I don't like how those loose jerseys are at the bottom, so I just tuck it in and roll it up. I get in trouble for it every once in a while. I have to come and hard time, pull my jersey out and tuck it in. NFL rules me that is Elliot. Da, da, da. So what is actual crop top? The stomach bearing tee uh, hasn't, hasn't only been worn by college football players. However, there have been a few other outliers making it look more gender neutral with every early champions of crop top being Lenny Kravitz and Prince. Okay, cool. Let's see this Lenny Kravitz and Prince wearing crop tops, right? Let's see what this looks like. Um, again, Lenny Kravitz and Prince, you know, are the you know the, the the if anyone if anyone's allowed to wear a crop top is those it's those two individuals. Prince here looks pretty cool in his crop top with some buttons on the top of it as well. That looks amazing, right? Um, again, here looks fucking incredible, bodied up. Again, here looks incredible, bodied up. And again, here looks incredible, bodied up. That's a really good crop top and pants. I wonder where that's from, brand wise. If you know, it's a, maybe a costume design. So like a crop top with a very f light material with massive pearl looking buttons on the top of the crop top and then it kind of goes down to the trousers. Look a little bit like heron pants. But yeah, he looks great in it. But again, you know, it's fucking Prince. I'm not going to take my cues from Prince. He's a legend. Um, and then of course you've got crop tops here in the show. You've got crop tops from um, Will Smith back in Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Huh. You have of course the iconic picture of, of Kid Cudi at Coachella. But again, like I said, I just don't think guys will do it unless they're bodied up. It's just not a thing that's going to really translate with all dudes. That looks amazing. I love that with the lace on there. There's something very, very nice about that. Where's that from? What brand is that? 
Ludovic des Ludovic des Saint Serene Spring Summer 2019 Summer Sadness just arrived at Depot TLA. The black leather tank top and matching black leather signature eyelet pants are now available. They look amazing. I'd wear that coat. I'd wear that to Bergheim straight away, man. It looks so good, doesn't it? Wow, 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 wow. Look at that. Nominated every of your image prize guys page sexiest menswear se sexiest menswear label in the right now is not become okay what's this cropped up brand here really thankful for the support and available on machine a eh? london based designer bianca saunders okay this is a quite nice cropped up i like that that's sort of like a, a hood cropped up right so it's like a, a cropped up that's sort of scrunched up but pulled up a little bit the trousers are a little bit low um what they call them low rise right and then the boxes are kind of pulled up a little bit like a Batman style right cool um, that was quite nice there you've got a, this is not really a crop top really i don't know why they included this in the picture from telfar just then they great trousers with the nice sort of shirt on top um and then you've got and someone here called danny who danny lomas i'm sure that is um wearing a crop top standing on a, a couch but again like i said i just think it's it's something that's going to be only going to be reserved to guys that have good bodies or look good in clothes in general um, I just don't think as a dude, if you're slightly chubby, you're gonna be comfortable wearing a crop top. But we just not we're, we're not we're not wired like women that way. We're not gonna just suck, you know. Guys wear things that complement their body more often than probably girls do. I would say for the most part, girls maybe wear things that accentuate some of their best features, but they might not look good in their entire body, right? So they might wear a really busty top that makes their tits look massive, but then you know they have, you know, their their belly looks like they're constipated whereas guys will just wear something that's just comfortable the whole way around you know that's why we're boring like that i'd say for the most part um but yeah that's crop top revival here happening um let's see if it happens in menswear i'm interested to see if it's going to be a thing and if it is pray for all of us